Hey guys, it's Levered01 here, and unfortunately, I have discovered something terrible. It appears that I cannot open the simulation in which we created a solar system from scratch last episode. So, what I'm gonna do is I remember we had a gas planet about 120 Earths. I believe so that's what I'm gonna put in and we're gonna just go from there so tools gonna add uh, wait no view all right add add powers material hydrogen moon I'm gonna have one moon's worth Actually, let's just have continuous beam of material. Oh, I like how the gas giant's atmosphere is doing stuff. That's cool. You know, I think we might make this uh, Earth. So it looks like that's working out, hopefully. Let's check the mass now. 287 Earths. Alright. Now, I'm gonna just put this right here. Wow, look. Oh, would you look at that? Alright. Let's, uh... Maybe seven orbit, let's make it still. Alright, it has a mass of about one Jupiter now. Alright, it's working out. Just want to see what happens if we put a Jupiter in here. Looks like we lost a lot of mass, though. Maybe I shouldn't do that. Oh well, let's just put it right inside. Because right now, I'm thinking with a little effort, we're gonna get this to be a star. Temp it's already yep now it's a star somehow somehow it's a star but I don't know how that works but I mean, if you compare it to any random hmm. I'm not gonna put stars in there because that's dangerous but now view Looks like it does, it's not even big enough to have a habitable zone, apparently. Uh, what? Okay, I'm, I have no idea what's happening anymore. has a mass of a star trailing around it. Let's try putting Jupiter in there again. So right now it's a glowing blue gas planet. And now it's a star. Are all stars this weak in size? Hold up, I'm just gonna put this here for comparison. 
What's the mass of this star? 164 Jupiters. Alright. I'm gonna look at the composition of this star. Because something about it seems a bit off. Yep, it has an incredibly high level of silicate, and I'm gonna kind of cheat here. I'm just gonna get rid of that silicate and that iron, and I guess we can keep the water. So let's add more gas giants. Uh, Jupiter, actually. View habitable zone. It still doesn't have a habitable zone? I don't know what to do about that. Alright. So, let's try putting in some more gas giants to just make it bigger more. I don't want to put a star in there because that's going to create problems. How big is this star? Something is wrong with this star. Maybe we should just completely get rid of the... Get rid of everything else. Hmm. Alright. Now can I see a habitable zone? Alright, I'm still not seeing a habitable zone. So, what are... I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put in we're gonna start trying to work on a on a planet for it so I'm not sure what a good distance would be maybe like for a star like this this might be a good distance I we just have to be careful not to accelerate it too much like 19.7 kilometers is a second is its velocity. So what we're going to do is we're going to maybe try to extend its orbit a bit. So we're going to launch. Is it seriously missing? I can't even tell what's happening. Yep, it's hidden. Um, okay. Alright, I don't know what happened. Alright, so this is our little moonlit right now uh view realistic realistic uh let's put that studio actually because right now i kind of want to see it wait let's look at its orbit right now uh-oh we messed up the orbit a little all right so so what needs to be done right now is we need to decelerate it. A few good sized asteroids might be able to do that. We're not really increasing the mass much. Hmm, how about something smaller? We can just use some material. But the material always seems to miss. Silicate. Mass. Kilograms. To the... 17. Maybe it's just too small of an object. Not working. Still not working. Alright. How's the orbit now? 
Alright, honestly, I have no idea. And I'm not sure how to make this work. So, what we might just do is keep hitting it with asteroids and hoping it works. Also, let's change this down to one. Hope so it gets more clumpy. What I gotta do is make sure that the hits are kind of from every side, because otherwise the velocity might get kind of crazy. And look, it's becoming spherical-ish. How big is it right now? Radius is 53 kilometers. And it seems like Universe Sandbox gets some of the physics wrong sometimes. Like, I'm pretty sure that the size required to get an actual object to be spherical is around 300 kilometers, but here it's 57 kilometers, and it seems pretty round. Also, it seems to be losing mass, and I don't understand why that is. Ah, it's because of the water. That's annoying. Oh, well. Keep hitting it. Doop 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 doop. Surprised it's not really heating up. Also, let's see where in orbit it is right now. Oh, we need to accelerate it, because otherwise this thing is going to die. Actually, if you... Let's go to trails instead. We're going to accelerate this boy so fast. Let's move closer. Hope we don't put in a retrograde orbit or something. That would be annoying. I think what my goal for this plant might to be... a to have a gas planet and then put an orbit around it we'll put a we'll put a habitable moon or something I don't think we're big enough for m small moons yet nope not quite actually we might Oh boy, I was wrong. Uh, let's get rid of that before that destroys it. This poor little moon. Man, I didn't think my computer could really lag. Maybe we can, like, limit the fragments or something. Yeah, we'll get rid of fragments and then... Um, there's some way we can get rid of all the fragments. Oh well. Hmm. Alright, the problem with realistic is that doesn't work. Flashlight is fine. Let's do that. Let's launch. So, why can't I click on this stupid thing? There we go. Fire, random small moon. Nope, bad idea. Bad, 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 bad idea. Alright, let's try this again. Hey, maybe I was thinking, what if there is some sort of setting we 
that could be used to, I don't know, change up the... Alright, let's add, um, tools, material, silicate, spread, Alright, let's increase the mass by about that much. Is that working? A bit, but maybe we should kick, keep asking it to go up. And no, no auto adjust. Alright, that's working. I asked for silicate. It's... Now we got a habitable moon on our hands. Alright. It's getting pretty big now. It'd be cool to make a, I don't know, a ring around this, but I don't think I can. Alright, you know what? I feel like I'm going to cheat on this one. Alright, so where in orbit is it? I can't even find the star. Uh, search. Alright, uh... Alright, what I'm gonna do is put you in orbit. Alright, uh, I'm gonna cheat a bit here. Inclination. Alright, there we go. Now we got in a good orbit, so I think what we're going to do is continue adding materials now. Uh, let's turn off orbits too, because this thing is starting to lag out and that's annoying me. Uh, That's a little large. For a sm Alright, how big? This is 1.94 moons. Alright, stats. Search. Is there some way to delete all these fragments? I guess the best solution is just not to have them in the first place, but. Oh well. Alright. Texture. Mm, performance. 60. Alright, I'm not really sure what to do about this. Hmm. Show hidden simulations. Alright, how do I get rid of this? Alright, forget it. I just have to deal with the lag. I mean, we could reduce the quality, but that's not fun. I should kick it up in order of magnitude. Alright, looks like that's working.
Not sure why it's already heating up to this thing. 90 degrees, but... Hey, look, that's pretty cool. There's still water on the back side of the planet. Not the front. Oh, there actually is still water, huh? It's weird. Alright, I'm gonna kick it up another order of magnitude. Man, I wish I knew that the spread thing, how the spread thing worked, or I would have, I would have used that tool before. Looks like we've gotten rid of almost all the water. Oh well. All right, now it's the size of Earth, so we're gonna kick it up even more. And this is going to get ridiculous pretty quickly. So now that we've formed that core of the planet, I think what I'm going to do now is we're going to do hydrogen. Or carbon dioxide, but I think I'll do hydrogen. Ugh lag is killing me all right this is working out pretty well so let's see so orbit still fine yep the orbit's fine all right Ugh, this lag is bad. Oh well, I think we made good progress now that we gave this system a planet. Let's see orbits now. Alright. And that's good. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more. Lever to one, signing out.